Well, only on Fox tonight, a David versus Goliath battle in Seabrook. Homeowners there are taking on Centerpoint Energy over a proposed substation that will likely impact property values. And tonight, the company, the company abruptly canceled a meeting with neighbors because we were there. Fox 26's Randy Wallace joining us live from Seabrook to tell us what's going on. Randy. Yeah, Jonathan. Now, I sent an email to Centerpoint Media Relations this afternoon telling them we were going to be at the meeting. But the Centerpoint representative who was present at tonight's meeting said he didn't get permission to be recorded and canceled the meeting. Every time we've gotten beaten down, there's been some strong voice or strong will in our group that, uh, sorry, <laughs> that, has, that has carried us through. For two years, residents who live in the Red Oaks Acre subdivision in Seabrook have tried to stop an unwanted new neighbor from moving in, an electrical substation for Centerpoint. You're disrupting families. You're disrupting wildlife. You're disrupting our, our livelihoods out here by putting a substation out here. You didn't even tell us. We are the average working class people and we're the prime target for a monster like Centerpoint. Residents say they have Seabrook City Council, a state rep, and a Harris County Commissioner on their side, but Centerpoint isn't budging. It doesn't matter. It seems like this, you know, billion dollar company is an unstoppable force. They have no oversight besides Public Utilities Commission, and, and they too are unreachable. Residents accuse Centerpoint of not being forthcoming about its plans. Every single piece of information that we've gotten has been through discovery. It's been through asking questions, open records acts, and just really pushing where we could. Like a rotating door for us. We give them questions, they come back to the table, they have no answers. We went to the mitigation meeting Wednesday night between Centerpoint and the residents, but Centerpoint was obviously upset with our camera being there and abruptly canceled the meeting. They had something to tell us tonight and they didn't want to say it in front of the cameras, in front of the public. So I feel like, you know, again, I feel like they're either hiding stuff or don't want people to know what they do. But I'm not sure why that can not also be heard by the public and all of the viewers. The meeting was apparently open to the public, but again, Centerpoint did not want us there. We will, of course, be at the next meeting. Reporting live from Seabrook, Randy Wallace, Fox 26 News.